and just sit right there. I'll tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air. In West Philadelphia, born and raised on the playground is where I spent most of my days. Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool, and all shooting some b-ball out the of the school. When a couple of guys who were up to no good started making trouble in my neighborhood. I got in one little fight and my mom got scared and said, you're moving with your nuts and your uncle in Bel Air. Day after day, but she packed my suitcase and sent me on my way. She gave me a kiss and then she gave me my ticket. I put my walk man on and said, I might as well kick it. First class, yo, this is bad. Drinking orange juice out of a champagne glass. Is this what the people of Bel Air live like? Ooh, this might be alright. But oh, wait, I hear the Prissy Boo's line on what? Is this the type of place that they send this cool cat? I don't think so. I see when I get there. I hope it's prepared for the Prince of Bel Air. The plane landed and when I came out, there was a dude like a dog standing there with my name out. I'm trying to get arrested, yet I just got here. I sprang with the quickness like lightning disappeared. I whistled for a cab and when it came near, the lights were like depression and dice in the mirror. If anything, I could say that this cab was rare, but I thought, man, forget it. Yo, home to Bel Air! Seven or eight, and I yelled to the cabin, go home, smell you later. Looked at my kingdom, I was finally there to sit on my throne as the Prince of Bel Air. Yeah.